so if we manage to get people out of their usual seats, mm -hmm. like break the fourth wall and place them closer to the action than the theaters, I think the theater manages to go, go meet its goal. You said also, okay, it's you, with this project you want to take, uh, not a risk for your theater, but it is a kind of experiment, yes, and um, sounds, I think it sounds very great. We'll, we'll contact you with all the details about the, the performance. It's more like audience work we are doing, it's not going to be community engagement, it's, uh, we will have a concert, in Guopio and this, uh, like a lecture performance discussion meeting. At the end of the show there is the involvement of the public for uh, doing a dance all together. This is Haberium. Take a moment before you start. In this space you can walk around, smell, touch, listen. Find your path. Zoom in. Zoom out. I hope next steps will be more into technology, but I also very much appreciate um, how this went and also the kind of this craftsmanship that is here, because all the stands are crafted by a visual artist from Poland. His name is Przemek Branas. Um, he's doing it by himself, um, experimenting in his studio slash apartment. Um, and all these objects are also kind of very organic and kind of analog, and I like it. And I appreciate that I could work this way. That we want it to be very intimate, that you have to really go very close to it to smell it. And we had a lot of fun and we had a total, total artistic freedom. <laughs> Und das Haus verhält sich 